वेलकम बैक स्टूडेंट्स यस्टरडे वी आर डिस्कस अबाउट द चैप्टर नंबर फर्स्ट ऑफ क्लास प्लस टू एंड टुडे एंड टुडे इज टॉपिक दैट इज अ टाइप ऑफ टूर्नामेंट्स नॉकआउट लीग और रॉबिन राउंड रॉबिन एंड कॉम्बिनेशन टूर्नामेंट्स so first of all we have to understand the meaning of tournament what is a tournament a tournament is a competition in which a team finally wins and rest of the teams lose the match the tournament are held according to the set rules and regulations it depend upon the various factors number of participating teams availability of ground equipments number of days funds the tournament are organized at various levels such as zonal district state national and international levels so firstly we have understand what is a tournament tournament is a competition in which a team finally wins and rest of the teams lose the matches and uh, it depend upon uh, uh, the availability of uh, grounds equipment particip- participating teams uh, number of days uh, so uh, tournaments are organized at various levels such as zonal district state national international levels tournaments are mainly of four types first that is a knockout tournament second name that is a elimination tournament and consolation tournament league or round robin tournament combination tournament or challenge tournament what is the importance of tournament this is a important point uh, Uh, how can you define a tournament and uh, write the importance of uh, tournaments so what is the importance of these tournaments these are the points given about the importance of tournament first that is a propagation of sports tournament helps in propagating sports the tournament creates interest in people it encourages them to take part in sports the spectators come to know about the sports so this is the um, importance of a tournament uh, and that it propagate the sports uh, it makes uh, more interest of people second point that is uh, to develop social qualities tournament develop social qualities like cooperation brotherhood tolerance sympathy some ethical values like honesty fair play justice and respect for others also develop so these are the social qualities are uh, developed uh, uh, with the taking pa- uh, pa- uh, taking taking part in uh, tournaments or in a game help in developing national and international integration sports tournament help in developing national and international integration and brotherhood because the tournaments are also played at international level like uh, uh, commonwealth like uh, asian games like uh, olympic games so these are the international level competitions in which uh, uh, like uh, Uh, near about eighty uh, percent of the countries of uh, all around the world are participating in those games. Develop sports skills. Tournament helps the players to develop sports skills, like technical and tactical skills of sports. So, to uh, by playing tournaments, uh, players are also. Uh, know about the uh, about the performance about the power of muscles about the uh, flexibility about the 
best performance of uh, the game if uh, they are participating in the tournaments fifth that is the source of recreation sports tournament are the source of recreation to the spectators <clears throat> that is why large number of people watch the world cup of various games and sports the sportsman learn to uh, learn the discipline by playing tournament the sportsman meet other sportsmen at a single platform so tournaments playing a very important role in the life of uh, players also in the life of others then move on to the second point that is a uh, uh, type of tournaments there are four types of tournament first that is a knockout tournament second that is a league tournament third that is a combination tournament fourth that is a challenge tournament so in this uh, uh, structure is given uh, what uh, to explain the uh, detail of these tournaments first that is a knockout or elimination tournament in which single knockout or a single elimination consolation tournament type first and second double knockout or double elimination tournament bagnell wild elimination tournament in second type tournament league or round tournament there are two types of tournament single league tournament or double tournament uh, about the procedure for drawing up fixtures and uh, then in a single or in a double uh, there are uh, three kinds of uh, fixture that is a cyclic method uh, tabular method or staircase method used in a single as well as double move on to the third that is a combination tournament knockout come knockout tournament knockout come league tournament league come knockout uh, league come league tournament league come knockout tournament there are four types of uh, <coughs> fixtures in a combination tournament and uh, move on to the four that is a challenge tournament in which uh, two types are given that is a ladder tournament or pyramid tournament so one by one we are going to discuss these four types of tournament knockout elimination tournament league round tournament combination tournament or challenge tournament move on to the first point that is a knockout tournament in a knockout tournament if a team is defeated once it automatically gets eliminated only the winner teams continue in the competition so keep in your mind mind uh, in a knockout tournament firstly the uh, when they start playing if a team is defeated then it automatically gets eliminated keep in your mind this is a knockout tournament if a team is defeated then automatically it eliminated and the winner team continue in the competition no second opportunity is given to the defeated team it is the fastest method to know about the winner team in the tournament about the advantages of knockout tournament economical this tournament is less expensive because the team gets defeated is eliminated from the competition second point that is the enhancing standard of competition the knockout tournament is helpful in enhancing the standard of sports because each team tries to present the best performance to avoid defeat so only one chance is given to the each team if uh, a team is defeated then no other uh, chance is given to that team only winner teams are appear in this type of tournament that is called knockout tournament 
uh, it also save time uh, due to less number of matches it, it requires less time to compete less officials less number of officials are required in organizing this tournament about the disadvantage of, of knockout tournament sometimes good teams are eliminated in first or second round there are chances of weak team to enter final round spectators may not have interest in the final match so this is a, a first type of tournament that is knockout tournament about a second type that is a league and round robin tournament league tournament are also called round uh, round robin tournament there are two types of league tournament single league tournament or double league tournament in single league tournament in this tournament every team plays with every other team once irrespective of victory or defeat to find the number of matches to be played in the single league tournament we have to follow the formula given below single league number of matches so this formula is used n n minus 1 over 2 n that is a number of team Uh, example is given if nine teams are taking part in a tournament the number of matches will be n is equal to number of times uh, number of teams so 9 into 9 uh, minus 1 over 2 9 9 minus 1 that is 9 minus 1 is equal to 8 9 into 8 that is 72 over 2 that is uh, equal to 36 matches so in single league tournament if nine teams are taking part in tournament then we have to play 36 matches to find winner <coughs> in league round robin tournament about double league tournament in a double league tournament every team plays with every other team twice irrespective of defeat or victory to find the number of matches to played in double league tournament we have to use a formula that is given double league uh, number of matches n n minus 1 this is the formula to find the matches n is equal to number of teams if six teams are taking part in tournament the number of matches will be 6 6 minus 1 that is 6 into 5 that is 6 30 matches if six teams are participating in this type of tournament then we have to play 30 matches to find the winner by using league or round robin tournament about the advantages of league uh, tournament west team bene- uh, benefited in a league tournament only strong team gets victory equal opportunity every team will get full chance to show their performance best talent selected in this tournament sports officials do not face any difficulty to find selecting or determining appropriate players no need to wait a team has no need to wait to win other teams for playing match <clears throat> sufficient time to perform large number of opportunities are available for the players about the disadvantage of league tournament this uh, type of tournaments are also time consuming they require much time also expensive these type of tournament waste time and money require more resources it requires more arrangement for sports officials and teams sometimes teams become psychological down due to continuous defeat in a tournament as more matches are played more injuries are observed so in these kind of uh, tournaments a team has to play continuously <clears throat> about third type that is a combination tournament combination tournament are conducted when the matches are to be played on the group basis or zonal basis these tournament depend upon the suitability of the activity the number of participating teams and the areas and the distance from which they come to participate 
depending upon the number of teams in each zone and the availability of time there are four types of combination tournaments first that is a knockout come knock league come league knockout come league league come knockout so in combination tournament there are four types of uh, tournaments uh, four types of fixtures uh, to draw first that is a knockout come knockout in this type of tournament the total number of teams are divided into equal four zones first of all the teams of each group play on knockout basis in this way a team become a winner from each group all the four teams from each group have to play again their matches in knockout basis so this is the formulation for example zonal tournament on knockout basis so firstly uh, teams are divided into four groups that is a a b c d uh, first then we have to play matches with first with second third with fourth and the winner from their groups uh, into each other winner from first group winner from second group then play again and one is winner from zone a just like that from zone b zone c and zone d winners are there winner a b c d and then play again just like that a or b c or d and then the winner from these groups play again and then finally we got the winner so this is a zonal tournament knockout basis about zonal tournament on league come league second type in this type of tournament the total number of teams are divided into four equal zonal group first of all the team of each zone group play on league basis in this way the winner of each zone uh, group have to play again league basis decide the winner so what is the formulation uh, what is uh, the fixture of uh, uh, league tournament this is a given uh, first we have to divide the teams in a four groups a b c d then draw the fixture just like that first with second first with third first with fourth and second with third second with fourth and then third with fourth just like that in a zone a b c d so this kind of a league uh, this is a league come league tournament and the winner from these all groups play again to decide winner winner from a b and then just like that in a pyramidal structure uh, we have decide the winner by using league come league tournament about zonal tournament on knockout come league in this type of tournament the total number of teams are divided in four equal zones first of all the teams of each group play on knockout basis in this way the teams which comes a winner from each group then have to play again matches on league basis so as you know about the knockout fixture that is a uh, given we have to divide the teams in a group then draw a fixture first into second third into fourth as you see uh, before just like that firstly the team have to appear in a knockout type and then play in a league type tournament so this is a knockout come league fourth that is a zonal tournament on league come knockout in this type of tournament total number of teams are divided into four groups first of all the team of each group 
play on the league basis in this way a team which is a winner from each group zone have to play again their matches on knockout basis so in in a league come knockout tournament firstly the teams are divided into four groups then play in a league to- uh, type tournaments and then the winner from league tournament then play on a knockout so this is the structure is given divided into four groups firstly they play league type tournaments and the winner from all zones play on the basis of a knockout tournament so these are the uh, four types of uh, tournaments are given so th- is this uh, this is enough for today uh,